what is up everybody i'm just in my um karcher account just testing and testing and testing right testing um a specific sales funnel testing the email autoresponder the sequence um making sure that that the that the, the that the countdown clock in the emails and the countdown clock on every single page aka sales page in this actual specific funnel this specific funnel consists of um one two three four five six seven eight nine ten there's 10 pages in the in this in this entire funnel <clears throat> lanny page takes them to a presentation it's a webinar so i'm driving people to a webinar to um, invest in my actual coaching and, and, and courses, right? So in that funnel, man, it's not just landing page, thank you page. There's freaking multiple pages. As you capture the lead, as you drive them to a, a, a landing page, right? Let's say, for example, I'm running Facebook ads, driving people to whatever. I'm either giving them a free download, I'm giving them a free um, um, PDF, click here to download your free PDF, your free buyer guide, your free seller guide, your free freaking 10 tips on how to crush it in affiliate marketing in 2020. Whatever the heck you're giving away for free, normally it's some type of PDF because it's so simple. It's free for you. It's, it's instant. It's automated. It's physical. It, it's something. It's information. It's based on what a specific audience is, is, is looking for. And that's everything, man. Whatever. Right? So, driving it to a simple landing page, capturing that lead, and then taking them, taking them to another page. That's web class in progress. Okay. As that person watches that 60 minute presentation, right in web class in progress, as they come over here, as they come over here and now they're boom, now they're watching a presentation, right? The bottom screen Right below the video, look, there's nothing there. This is as low as I can go. So that goes on. Let's say, for example, it's a 60-minute presentation, right? Let's say it's a 60-minute presentation. That video goes on. 45 minutes in, that person gets tagged. They're tagged. Either they watched it at a 45-minute, let's say you were, you're doing a 55-minute presentation, and as long as you get in, that person watches at least 45 minutes, you could tag them. If they watch 50 minutes, if they watch 10 minutes, if they watch the entire thing, you can tag them, right? And so if they don't cross that time stamp, they're not tagged, right? And so that's how when, when they opt in, they came to the landing page, they enter their name and email, then they came here, right? They either watched it or they didn't. If they watched it, that's my communications to the left. So my communications, hover over that, click on sequences. This is your email autoresponder. So you're going to tie a sequence to a list. Whoever's opting into a specific landing page or they're a customer, they're on a specific list. And it's up to you to create the sequence. That's the handful of drips. That's the drip system. That's what's going to come out over the next few days, right? And so in this specific case, this is what I wanted to show you. So this is the sequence when they opt in and they, and, and they go and they watch the video or not. Okay. So if they watch the video or not, that's going to determine whether they go to the true side or to the false side. Okay. So let me show you this. The starting rule, right? This is my email autoresponder. This is my drip system. These are a handful of emails that I already pre-wrote, um, talking to my audience, getting my audience to do one thing, and that's to watch that presentation to either watch the replay or to purchase. That's the whole bottom line, right? So the starting rule is anyone who uh, uh, registers, web class registration. So anyone who fills out that form, I could tag it, I could tag them, list, whatever, order. Anyone who buys this product, put them on this list. I could, and, 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 and it's not this list it's the fact that the starting rule is based on whatever happens that's what starts the rule okay so in this case it's web class registration okay and then the split one hour later let's say it's a 50 minute video a 50 minute presentation and you tagged them 45 minutes in one hour later the system is going to see if they have that tag 
So did they hit 45 minutes? If they did, then they would have this tag, TSREA, right? So you can name it whatever the hell you want to name it. This tag is applied when they hit the 45 minute mark, okay? That makes the system know, okay, do we send them to the left or do we send them to the right? Do they have the tag or do they not have the tag false? Do they not have the tag? So if they only, if it's a 55 minute presentation and they only watch 10 minutes of it, automatically, boom, they're going to the false. So an hour later, an email is going to go out. What happened? Okay. And then, and then if they, if they do have the tag, if they watched the entire thing, let's say they watched 50 minutes of it, they for sure got the offer. They for sure knew about the entire program and, and, and they were tagged. And so an hour later, this is an email. They, it goes to the true side. This is an email that they would get. Thanks for attending, John. And then, and then one day later, here's the gift I promised. One day later, I made this video for you. One day later, here's Candy's Facebook page. One day later, agents wasting time doing Facebook Lives. One day later, what's worse than expired milk, right? So, so after, and that's it. So to the left, true, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But that seventh one is really, will you tell me why? That's when they're already like, you, they went to the true side because they watched it, right? But they didn't purchase. So they, they got all the way down over here. And then, and, then, and then two days later, I'm sending them, will you tell me why? And all that is is a survey. I'm saying, hey, John, thanks. Obviously, you, didn't, you did not take me up on my offer. If you can do me a huge favor and fill out this basic survey to tell me why, you'll even have a chance to tell me off if you want to tell me off, right? That's a simple survey that I created in Google Docs or Google Survey or whatever. Um, and, and, and so that's where I'm, I'm, I'm going to start getting feedback from, from what's not working, right? That allows me that data, good, good feedback, you know, bad feedback. It allows you to, you know, continue to, you know, um, tweak your, your, your product or your service to meet what the audience really wants. Right. So that's a survey that I'm going to go for, you know, but that's two days later, but this one, what's worse than expired milk. That's pretty much the last one. So I'm taking them down. They watched it. They went to the true side. One, two, three, four, five, six. So six emails. Okay. And that is what I tested over here. So look, this is what I tested. So today is the 18th of April. On the 13th, I opted into my own page. Boom. An hour later. Thanks for attending, Dave. Got this one, April 13. And then April 14, here's the gift I promised. April 15, I made this video for you. Here's Candy's page, April 16th. Okay, and then, and then, and then April 17th, agents wasting time. Right here, we're right, we're right here, agents wasting time doing Facebook Live. And then, and then the next email that will come out uh, today, the 18th, will be um, this one right here, what's worse than expired milk. That comes out a, a day later, right? So it's all based on the tags. If they haven't purchased, they're gonna continue to get that true side. On the right side, if they haven't watched it, if that tag, the automation, so, so what happened, right? An hour later, I, I'm going to know that you didn't watch it because you don't have the tag. So an email is going to go out. What happened? And look, I tested this one over here. So April 13th, I opted in, right? Testing my own funnel. And then boom. April 13th, hey, Dave, what happened? April 14th, Dave, can you finish today? April 15th, did you get my last email? So what happened? Can you finish today? Did you get my last email? The next one is I'm, I'm only looking for the 1%. Dave, I'm only looking for the 1%. Boom. And then this is text that I wrote out, dude. This is text that I wrote out. This is stuff that I know about my audience, right? And then boom, countdown clock. This countdown clock is on every email. So every email that's going through to the true side and to the false side, there's that countdown clock. That countdown clock is based on a tag, okay? So that countdown clock, I'll come over here and, 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 um, and I'll create a tag. I'll come in and create a tag. And then, and then what I can do is I can go to categories. I'm going to go to um, this one. And these are the tags that I have. Look, finished web class. 
that right there, finished web class, okay? Here's how you do that. You have to put that video on Kartra. That cannot be a Vimeo video. That cannot be a Wistia video. That cannot be a YouTube video. Um, in order to track that with an actual tag, which is what you're going to want to do, upload the video to Kartra. So right here, take it from your downloads, right? Take it from your computer, upload it. It's this video right here, okay? Now you notice I have one tag. So what I do is I come in here, I hit edit, and I'm gonna add a tag. I'm gonna add a, tam a timestamp, okay? So a timestamp. I'm gonna come in here to tag leads, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna tag them at the eight minute mark. So let's say for example, it's a 10 minute video, which this is, right? I'm testing it, but you know, this is exactly how you do it. That's a 10 minute video. I tag them at the eight minute mark. So that, that, so again, an hour later, the system's going to show, going to, going to, going to see, you know, which, who has this tag. If they have that tag, then they continue, right? Then they continue. And so the ones, the one over here, this guy over here, he hasn't watched it. Dave, what happened? Dave, can you finish today? Did you get my last email? Dave, I'm only looking for the 1%. And then this is, this is the very last one. So this is the very last one that came out 16 minutes ago. Well, at least you tried. Better luck next time. As long as you're closing escrows, Dave, the heck with what I'm saying. I'm just convinced that most agents have no clue how to build their business on social media. And all I want to do is help. Dave, none of this was my opinion right? So I'm just taking them through. And then now very, very last, last freaking call to action. I'm getting them to subscribe. This is a person. Let's hit cancel. Let me go back to the actual sequence. This is a person that is on the false side, right? This person is on the false side. You get an E for effort. What happened? Can you finish? This is a person that opted in, but they never had that tag. As the system's taking them through, they don't have that tag of finished web class, right? So that right there is super powerful, man. This it, That's the false side. Okay, so the false side. So again, emails go out. It's the automation. Look at the automation. So every every day, the automation is going to check if they actually have the tag, have they gone over? Because look, lead reach, reaches this step and has tag, move them to the true side. So if they have that tag, <clears throat> move them to the true side. Uh, move lead to step two, which is, which is the, the left side. So over here on the left side, true, there's the number two. So, so if they have that tag, right They're, they they finally okay false 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 but then i take them down to here i take them down to the very i take them i take them down to here i'm only looking for the one percent right which is this one right here because right here look this countdown clock man that's what i'm saying the tag is based around this countdown clock so so when i go and set up the countdown clock i just put that tag and that tag reads every clock, and then I put the time five days. That's what I do. You could put two days. You could put ten hours. You know, you can create hardcore deadlines in one hour, right? You you and, and you could put that countdown clock. So now that countdown clock. Look, two hours, thirteen minutes, five seconds. This is an email, right? This page over here. Let me um, let me click on let me click let me click on any of these. So look, they can pull up any of these previous emails that same countdown clock, that same countdown clock. And then if, if I actually click on the link, now I'm going to the web class. So let's say again, this is a person over here that did not watch it yet. And then now they finally get over here and they watch it. There's no drop down just yet. That, that drop down will, will drop down in a few minutes, right? So if you have a 50 minute presentation, that drop down can drop down in 45 minutes. That's when you tag them. That's when your offer pulls up and then boom, they're taken, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> they're taken to, um, let's see, let's, I have another link. Uh, that's watch here. Um, 
Yeah, this is the can you finish. So again, these are people that haven't even seen the presentation yet. That's this side, okay? I'll show you the other side. This is for people that have not finished yet. So boom, I'm finally taking them back to the web class. They haven't even seen the offer, <clears throat> their web class in progress, okay? <clears throat> once they do, once they do watch it. Now, these are all thanks for attending. This is now for people who watched it. They have the tag. They completed it. Now, this is a whole handful of emails that I wrote out. Now, going to the left side, okay? So, this is the left side now, right? The true side. Thanks for attending. Here's a gift I promised you. I made this video for you. So, in this case, what I'm taking them to, look, click here to find a complete list. So as I take them to different pages of the funnel now, remember I showed you over here, there's 10 pages. These are all the different pages. So now this countdown clock, these are for everyone who's already seen the offer. This countdown clock is now on everything. Get all your bonuses here. Taking them straight to the checkout. That checkout, that, that cart should be folding out connecting to secure payment there we go so this countdown clock okay now pay attention to it two hours 13 minutes that countdown clock here's 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 candy's facebook page look so it's another email another email that i wrote out another email talking to the audience and then getting them to another page that i'm facebook pixeling right Facebook pixeling, and now I'm showing them a different video of me doing something completely different, but building value and, and, and showing, justifying why you, why you need this, right? Um, and I'm showing them just results from another, from another client, and then boom, they already seen the offer. So now this countdown clock, because you know I add the countdown clock and then tie it to that tag, right? That countdown clock is going to be everywhere now. So on all these, on all these rest of the emails, um, I made this video for you. So I'm taking them to another page now, taking them to another page. They already seen the offer. They are, they're, they're tagged. They already seen, you know, seen 45 minutes of your 50 minute video. So, so, so showing them the price now that's going to remain in their face. And, and now it's going to be another video. <clears throat> the only Facebook ad you need to capture local buyer and seller leads. <clears throat> so be me on video, you know, five minute video. <clears throat> excuse me, 10 minute video, right? Just creating more value, creating more value around their pain, around their freaking, you know, desires, right? And then, and then just that countdown clock, that countdown clock, that countdown clock, you know, continues to, to tick. It'll tick on every page and it'll tick in, you know, different emails that I put it in. So Facebook, this one. Yeah. So there's that same countdown, two hours, 11 minutes, and you're going to find that on every page and it's all of these pages it's all of these pages 10 pages um depending on which side they go they go to the left side true side they go to you know the 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 right side the false side those are all emails that i wrote out one time and now just focused on driving traffic driving traffic through the funnel and 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 finding those you know those few that you can bring value to so that that that's simple right there you guys i wanted to share that with you so um everything i run through kartra my entire landing page and my entire email automation so and my membership course and um and what else and um my affiliate marketing and my calendar um and my products so i all my digital products whether it's an ebook, whether it's coaching, whether it's consulting, whatever, a digital product, whether it's my membership course, all of that is all processed through Kartra. So I can track everything um, and it's super, super powerful. So there's a 14 day trial, profitwithkartra.online. Um, <clears throat> and that's, that's my entire sequence, man. That's my sequence. Those are different pages. That's the countdown clock. And that's driving people to an online course and just drop in value, man. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. Over and out.